Welcome to another enlightening episode of Soulful Sketches where we dig into the intricate narratives of the Bible to uncover profound lessons for our spiritual journey. In today's episode, we explore the compelling story of Rachel and Leah, two sisters whose lives were marked by envy, rivalry, and the search for contentment in the face of challenges. Our journey today leads us to Genesis chapter 30 verse 1. where these poignant words resonate when rachel saw that she bore jacob no children she envied her sister she said to jacob give me children or i shall die have you ever heard of the term facebook envy facebook envy is the painful feeling one gets when they realize other people's lives on facebook are more interesting joyful and worthwhile than theirs In an article by Sandeep Roy titled Facebook Envy: Seven Sad Facts, we find the following. Facebook makes users dissatisfied and envious. One third of people felt worse and more frustrated with their lives after going to Facebook. Almost 30% felt that envy was the major reason. Envy ranked the highest in causing Facebook frustration. The practice of polygamy seen in the lives of Abraham, Jacob and other biblical figures carried complex dynamics that often led to familial tensions. The story of Rachel and Leah exemplifies the strife that can arise within such relationships. Jacob's favoritism toward Rachel, despite her barrenness, deepened the chasm between the sisters. Rachel's longing for motherhood evolved into envy and fear of losing Jacob's love ultimately leading to a plea for children that highlighted her desperation in moments of personal struggle whether infertility financial distress family conflicts failure or other setbacks it's easy to fixate on the successes of others and harbor envy as we compare our circumstances to those of others bitterness can take root deceiving us into believing that our entire life hinges on resolving our problems Rachel and Leah's journey serves as a reminder that true contentment is not found in circumstantial resolutions or material achievements rather it's rooted in a relationship with God who offers his unwavering presence regardless of life's challenges Embracing his guidance and seeking his comfort enable us to navigate envy and discontent redirecting our focus from what we lack to the divine fulfillment found in him a time for self reflection let's reflect on the themes of envy contentment and god's presence in our life one examine moments when envy has arisen due to personal challenges or the successes of others second consider how true contentment differs from temporary circumstantial relief third reflect on the role of god's presence in finding peace and fulfillment a prayer for you today let's seek inspiration from rachel and leah's journey as we engage in prayer heavenly father help me overcome envy and discontent in the face of challenges Teach me to find contentment in your presence and trust your guidance. May my focus shift from worldly desires to the fulfillment that comes from a relationship with you. Amen. With heartfelt blessings. This is Reverend Jejo Vargas bidding you farewell until our next enlightening episode of Soulful Sketches. May the story of Rachel and Leah inspire you to see contentment in God's presence and release the grip of envy. in your life god bless you